Arnon Bernhardson and the girls soccer team, the senior girls soccer team here at KSS going back to the provincials for the second consecutive year. Let's talk about the final. You played the Boucherie Bears in the Valley uh, Championship game winning 2-1. It must have been an exciting game. Yeah, it was an excellent game. Uh, it was a uh, back and forth affair between the both teams. Um, great afternoon. Um, standard soccer wasn't as good because the field conditions weren't very good but uh, excitement uh, it was a very exciting game back and forth uh, scoreless first half uh, we got on the board early I uh, think about uh, 59th minute we got a goal and they equalized in about the 61st minute then it was back and forth uh, chances both ways right till the end um, First overtime scoreless, and then we they had an injury um, about um, three and a half minutes into the second overtime. Um, one of their girls cramped up. Um, there was a little lull uh, while they took her off the field, so I was able to get my team together. We talked a little strategy, and uh, it paid off. Let's talk about the provincials now, going back for the second year in a row. Does that pay off that you're going back for the second year in a row? Does it matter because it's a fresh crop of players and, and schools? Um, yeah, I, I think it does matter because, I mean, the people that were there with us last year, they're all returning players, so whether they're grade 12s or grade 11s, uh, so they have an idea what's going on. Um, there's some new grade 10s that um, did not play with us, obviously, last year. Um, but a lot of them have some provincial experience uh, playing uh, BCSPL, some KU teams and stuff like that who have made it to provincials. Um, obviously, they haven't made it to provincials with us, uh, so it's a little bit different story. Some are field hockey players, some are basketball players, so they have some provincial experience, but other than that, um, yeah, it, it does make a difference. Provincials are in Vancouver, and there's the rolling strikes that are coming into effect. Will that affect anything to do with, with the provincial soccer championships? I don't think so, because Vancouver is out on Monday, um, and we play Thursday, Friday, Saturday, um, and there's no... Um, no news that we have that they're going to escalate the rotating strikes other than they're going to do rotating strikes next week. Uh, should not affect us. Uh, Okanagan is out on Tuesday, which doesn't affect our travel day, which will be Wednesday. I mean, you're going in somewhat blind. You don't know who's going to be at this championship. Yeah, I have a, I have some idea. Like I know which six teams are coming out of Fraser Valley. I know Argyle's there, defending champion. They won the North Shore. Uh, New West was uh, is a... Uh, a team coming out of uh, North Shore as well should be pretty decent. Uh, they have a very good athletic program. Um, I think Stelly's is coming from uh, Victoria uh, out of Vancouver Island. They haven't lost any games this year, um, so they'll be very strong. Um, the dark horse is McMath out of Vancouver Richmond. Um, the story on them is that they have eight or nine uh, BCSPL players plus some provincial team players as well. Uh, they've won the Vancouver Richmond zone um, and they came second in Victoria. So, um, you know, they should be a very good squad. Now, where's KSS ranked? Uh, we're, there's really no ranking. Um, I think that um, right now we'd probably be ranked somewhere, I would say, top six. Mm -hmm. Top players on your team that you're going to look to to, to lead the squad in provincials? Um, well, the two captains, Morgan Hughes and Courtney Hemmerling. Um, Kenny Snape is a, a huge addition for us. Um, grade 11 um, player who's very strong. Those three, those would be the big ones. And then uh, Rachel McMillan in the back and uh, Anjume Quinnell in goal. And coach, well, good luck down there. Thank you. Arnold Bernhardson, he's the senior girl soccer coach at KSS, and they're going back to the provincials for the second straight year.